I mean, I don't know where to start. I mean, it can't be that bad. Have you been having the time of your life? Well, yeah, it was at first, but I don't know. Everything's happened so fast. You can't spit it out already. Okay, fine. You know how Ryan and I learned the other room to talk? Yeah. Well, it turns out he learned to a lot more than talk. Oh my god, Amy, I'm so happy for you! Well, I'm not happy. That wasn't what I wanted. I, oh, I wait, 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 wait. What do you mean it wasn't what you wanted? You never shut up about him. I know. Trust me. I'm just as shocked as you are, but I thought we were just going to get to know each other. I didn't know that. That what? That he would see you in this stunning dress and not get excited? I mean, isn't this the reason you wore it? To get his attention? No. I wore this dress because it made me feel pretty, but now I'm going to be Oh, Jesus, Abby, you're being so difficult. I mean, you got to sleep with him. You're the luckiest girl in the school right now. Well, I don't feel lucky. Don't you understand? He forced himself on top of me. It all started with me thinking we were just going to talk. But he had this devilish look in his eyes. He pushed my chest, making me stumble. He pinned my arms above my head. He then told me to shut up. This did not make this any more difficult than it had to be. So I complied. With tears filling my eyes, he forced apart my legs and he grabbed my neck. You know what? Maybe you're right. 